have to worry about darkness anymore because we have the light of Jesus. Oh, hi, Pickles. Oh, hi, Pastor Ken. Hi, Dilly. Uh, what are you doing with all them Christmas lights wrapped around you? Well, Pastor Ken, you preached today that Jesus is the light of the world. So, I thought if Jesus is the light of the world, then I need to light myself up so everyone can see the Jesus who lives inside of me. Well, I did preach on that. Uh huh. But, you know, you don't have to wrap yourself up in lights for people to see the light that's inside of you. Oh. Well, I guess I took that literally. You did, but it's okay. <laughs> yeah. Hey, uh, I gotta go find this Andrea because okay. we're supposed to meet for lunch. Okay. Uh, but before I go, yeah. do you need help unwrapping all those lights from around you? Um, nah, Dilly and I have it. We're good. Thank you, though, Pastor Ken. Go enjoy your lunch with Miss Andrea. Okay. Okay. All right. See you later. Bye, Pastor Ken. Oh, by yeah. the way, don't forget to shine your light for Jesus. <laughs> I will sure do that, Pastor Ken. Don't worry. Well, kids, with the Christmas season and all the Christmas lights, I thought I needed to wrap myself in Christmas lights to show the light of Jesus that lives inside of me. But that's just not the case. With Christmas coming up, we'll be celebrating the birth of Jesus, and I'm so excited about that. I really love the Christmas season, especially looking at all the lights that light up the neighborhood. And, you know, it's kind of sad to think. When Christmas is over, all the lights come down, the trees come down, the stockings come down. But it's exciting to know that the light of Jesus that lives inside of us it doesn't have to quit shining just because Christmas is over. The Bible tells us in John chapter 8 verse 12 that I am the light of the world, meaning Jesus is the light of the world. Whoever follows me, meaning follow Jesus, will never walk in darkness, but will walk in the light of life. Jesus is the light of life. When you ask Jesus to come and live in your heart to be your Lord and Savior, His light will lead you and it will guide you. He will always help us. That's so exciting to know that God, He never fades and He never goes away. He is the same forever. So kids, go shine your light for Jesus and shine so very bright. Now, I have to unwrap myself from all these lights. Huh. I'll see you next week for Christmas. Oh, Dilly, this is going to be a job. Whew. <laughs>